I believe 2023 has to be many things, but above all else, 2023 has to be the year of BSG. And crucially, many organisations rightly understand the E, but it needs to be E, S and G. The S and the G of equal importance to the E. So it's E, S, G, horizontally through every beat point of every business. To put it in terms, ESG, existential, seismic, global. The greatest examples of BSG and indeed inclusion, diversity, successes are where institutions, organisations, businesses take a system-wide, a people-wide, an organisation-wide approach to the issue at hand and never try and short circuit it. And with all, what could we do that could help to move the dial in this area? Following a whole heap of work by our advisory and by members, volunteers who put themselves out to say, yeah, I care about this. We've developed a, a strategy and a whole program of activity that are going to help us to move the dial, dial up on diversity, sure, but also looking at the environment and sustainability and government, governments, uh, governance as well. It's a brilliant example of, of, of this essentially being created out of, the, out of the womb of the community. Never half do it, never believe you can cherry pick bits of it to the detriment of other parts of it. It's either inclusive by design or it's not. And the great good fortune is Ultimately, it's about focusing every day at every beat point and every element on engendering, on enabling the flourishing of an inclusive culture very much with inclusive leadership. That's the mission. I believe that those people who care about more than just their own little microcosm, who consider that they could leverage enormous change and impact by collaborating in a smart way through this project should jump on board get involved talk to us share stories have fun create good stuff align resources and get some breakthroughs and then i think they'll be able to fulfill their duty as not just members of the payments association but as good honest citizens of society